You see, right now I'm in a room of about 5,000 leaders. And the theme for this, this time that we have together is leadership developed. What does that mean? It simply means that leaders just don't happen. It's a process. When you decide that you're going to do something and you're going to do it at a high level, it doesn't stop there. What you need to recognize is that what defines a leader is not doing one monumental thing. It's not doing this one thing and saying, ta-da, yay, look at me, yay. You know, that's not it. It's great. But what defines a leader is what that person does when they experience hardship, when they experience an ugly, when they experience an obstacle. What defines a leader is what you do when you experience that. Nobody likes it when I do that. And yet, why did I? I'll tell you. I'm a visual learner. I want you guys to see firsthand what I'm talking about because I believe if you see it, you will leave here and you'll remember it. Then all of a sudden, boom, we experience something like this. And what does this represent? It represents those moments when we feel downhearted when we feel discouraged, when we feel alone, when we feel like we just want to camp out by the water cooler of life. But you see, leaders aren't content with throwing in the towel. Leaders have this thing within them where they dig deep and they call upon it. And it's called the heart of perseverance. Leaders are somebody who looks at this and recognizes that we've got to keep moving forward. I don't have to like this, I don't have to be happy about it, but I've got to do something about it because if I don't, it wins and I lose. Oh, I know, I know what you guys are wanting to scream out. Uh, dude, yeah, hey, hello, you ADD guy, you're making it worse. And if we leave it, we're missing an opportunity to grow through it. Young people, look at me, I want you to hear this. My teacher taught me something extremely valuable. She taught me that in this life, these obstacles, they serve a purpose. If you choose to see them in the way that you need to see them, these actually are an opportunity to mold you and shape you into strong men and amazing women if you let them. Sure, my guy looks like a Sasquatch, but that's okay. The message is we're not meant to stay here. Notice the pose. He keeps moving forward. Sitting is not an option. We've got to battle through the uglies in life because that's where we want to be, right there. <clears throat> Finally, Rocky looks at his son and he says this, son, nothing is going to hit you harder than life. Nothing. It does not matter how hard you can hit. What matters is how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward.